Even after your beautiful summer flowers have died, your garden can still be a show. Until a hard freeze, many annuals, perennials, and shrubs bloom in the fall. Even after that, there are some flowers that bloom in late winter or very early spring. By adding these plants that bloom in the fall to your garden and pots, you can extend the growing season. Also, many fall flowers look great with pumpkins and gourds in fun seasonal displays. Number 1. Sweet Alyssum Sweet Alyssum has dainty pink or white flowers that look beautiful tumbling over the edges of containers or spilling over walls. Despite its delicate appearance, it's actually quite hardy and will tolerate a few light touches of frost. Number 2. Marigold. These perennials are so tough that they can survive the night's low temperatures and even a touch of frost. Because they bloom continually from the time of planting until there is a severe freeze, you get a significant amount of floral power. After the seed heads have bloomed and become dry, sniff them off so you can keep them and plant them the following spring. Number 3. Asters. When most of the other plants in the garden are starting to lose their luster, these perennials are just getting started. They start flowering at the same time that mums do and come in a variety of colors, including blue, lavender, pink, and purple. Number 4. Shrub Rose. Roses are surprisingly hardy plants that require significantly less care than their reputation would lead you to believe they would need. Roses that grow on shrubs or in landscapes bloom continuously during the growing season and continue to do so well into the fall, providing a source of color far into the season's later stages. The newer strains are significantly less susceptible to illness. Number 5. Black-Eyed Susan These golden flowers with centers that might be either brown or black button are perfect for autumn gardening. In the average year, black-eyed Susans bloom anywhere from the middle of summer to the middle of fall, providing dependable color for a whole season. There are types that are annual and others that are perennial. Number 6. Coral Bells Hugera, commonly known as coral bells, is a cold-hardy perennial that is grown largely for the vibrant foliage that it produces. It comes in a wide variety of colors, ranging from the darkest burgundy to the brightest lime green and everything in between. Long after the other annuals in your garden have faded, the gorgeous leaves with their frilly edges will continue to create splashes of color. Number 7. Helenium Helenium was once used as snuff, earning its nickname Sneezeweed.inch. This flower comes in deeply saturated shades of red, orange, and yellow, and blooms from late summer to fall. Butterflies adore this plant. Place it at the back of borders for late season color. Number 8. Pansy and Viola These pretty, funny-faced flowers with bright colors prefer cooler weather. They'll even handle a light frost or two. They come in an array of beautiful colors from pastels to deep, saturated oranges and reds. Number 9. Snapdragon. This annual plant stands tall and looks fantastic in a variety of containers since it adds vertical appeal. There are also sorts that lag behind. Snapdragons are hardy flowers that bloom all the way up until the ground freezes solid and come in practically every color imaginable. Number 10. Chrysanthemums. Mums are the fall flower. They're sturdy, don't mind a light frost, and come in a rainbow of colors. Technically, they're perennials, but they won't come back if you don't get them in the ground by mid to late summer, because they need to get their root systems established before the ground freezes. But they're inexpensive enough to enjoy for one season, and some do occasionally return, even if you planted late. Well, that's all for today's video, guys. If you like this video, don't forget to click the like and subscribe button for supports our channel.
Also, you can turn on the notification bell for latest videos from us. Well, see you in the next interesting topics.